Okay, so uh, I did some grinding and uh, fought a whole bunch of stuff, got a bunch of money, and uh, it's day seven. Uh, I'm walking out of the Caddis Tail Inn, and uh, what do I know? This bum has uh, wandered his way over to the outside of the inn. Um, some team for the poor, Effendi. Send team for the poor. Um, I'm going to ignore him because uh, I have no interest in giving him any money. Uh, so I'm going to go to my trusty map. Um, I realize now why Rakesh was not in the guild hall before, uh, and that's because he only shows up on day seven. So I'm going to go over to the guild hall now, and there he is. You have saved the city with your courage and your resourcefulness. The land of Shapir is indebted to you. By order of the Sultan Harun al-Rashid, I have been asked to give you this as a reward for your actions. Rikis gives you the 50 dinar reward. We got some points for that. We are all truly fortunate that you came to this land. Thanks. I am honored to aid you. Um, let's uh, return the reward. You show great honor. Okay, everyone. Oops, sorry about that. You show great honor. May something. I missed the end of that because I hit my phone. Sorry. Uh, but yeah, the reason we did that is because we want to make sure that we stay on the path to being a paladin. And just to give you uh, an idea, uh, we now have 66 honor, which is, you know, pretty good uh, considering. And as you can see, a lot of our other stats have gone up. Uh, I realize that there's a few things I'm not doing at all, and that's throwing, climbing, and dodging. <laughs> so, um, basically every time I get into a fight, uh, I'm just swinging away madly, and I'm hardly at all uh, using any of those other things. Um, so, there's a bunch of uh, other things to do on day 7. And the next thing uh, that we need to do is go listen to our friend Omar, who is by the apothecary now. Um, so let's go back to our map and go to the fountain plaza. Not this side of the fountain plaza, the other side. And they ask, what is a hero? Though the answer is very clear, he's the one who faces danger when the darkness hovers near. He will face the fiercest foe when another needs his aid. He will dare to defy death, even though he is afraid. He works not just for glory, and he does it not for gain, because he knows that others will be spared a greater pain. Now, something about this text, just so you know. Uh, you can click through it, but it's going to pop up when it's going to pop up, regardless of if you hit enter or not, so... He won't always follow orders, for he dares to answer why, and unless he likes the reason, he refuses to comply. He will brave the boldly wait, he will brave the battle boldly, even though he may not win, he will face his fate unflinching, for he is a paladin. Hmm. How does he know? You see like this time in between that I'm waiting? And they ask, what is a hero, though the answer's evident. He's the one who faces death, knowing that his life's well spent. Okay, and uh, I think that's it. Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure that's it. Uh, so, what happens now is if I walk off the screen... And then I walk back. <gasps> They're gone. But... Scory says, would you like to try some fried bread and honey? 
What about some nice lizard jerky? Mmm, -mm, I could go for some lizard jerky myself. Uh, yeah, if you go to where they are, it seems like they left something behind. Um, let's click on it. You see a small leather purse on the plaza floor. You pick up the purse and open it. It has 16 dinars and 25 centimes. It also has a small scrap of paper with the words Quelling Chaos from Shapir, Driving Darkness from Rasir. Okay, so, uh, that's that. Um, so, uh, we know that Omar stays at the Cotta's Tail Inn, so maybe if we go back there we could find him? That was weird. Why didn't our map pop up? So let's go to the Kata's Tail Inn. Mm. Alright, Shamin, ask about Omar. Poetry is revered in this land. Okay, so he's just gonna give me the generic Omar answer. Um. So he's not here, um, so I guess whenever we do see Omar, uh, we're gonna have to make sure that we return his purse. Um, there is one other thing that we can do, and, uh... You know what? I'm just gonna give this guy a symptom because we have so much money. Thank you, thank you, Effendi. You ashamed me for my kindness. Uh, just because I'm curious if my honor goes up. No, apparently not. But uh, maybe I got some experience for it? I'm not really sure. I don't know why I would get experience for something like that. Um, all right. Uh, nothing happens until the next day, guys, but like I said, there is one other thing I can do on this day. And that is by going back to the money changer, because I believe on day seven, the money changer, if you're going the thiefy way, allows you to do one of her things. Ah, the sunshine returns to our corner of the alley. Would you like me to be of service to you? Um, so I'm going to save the game real quick, uh, and I'm going to replace this with uh, day seven to eight. And uh, I'm going to make thief sign because today would be place your thumb on your nose with the hand okay so I do this well young jackal may fortune always favor you uh, ask about thief ask about job says from the right sort of person when the time comes arrangements might be made okay well let's leave then sometimes you just need to leave and come back um, so I may have been mistaken perhaps it is not this day um, I've seen many seen many men in my time and you're certainly one of them okay well she's just gonna basically flirt with me um, but uh, whenever it is that I find out the right day uh, to do those thiefy things, uh, I will. Uh, 
go and revisit our friend Dinarzad and I will make a save file to show you guys what it is that you do. Uh, but until then, I'm going to go to sleep, and when I return, we will continue our adventure. Alright guys? Enjoy. See you next time.